Santa's little helpers getting ready to give the post office a hand. They're preparing for the busiest mailing day of the year. On Monday, more than 612 million pieces of mail will be sent. The Postal Service wants you to get your shipments on time, so if you want your package by Christmas, standard post shipments need to be done by December 15th. Any later orders will likely require you to pay extra shipping fees. Your holiday shipments may come a little late this year. On-time delivery rates for UPS are now at 91%. This time last year, they were at 97%. Software developer ShipMatrix looked at the delivery rates for millions of packages. It, will, it also takes you longer to get your package sent through FedEx. On time delivery at 95%, which is lower than usual. UPS in particular has been slammed because so many of us are shopping online this year. That's the difference. The Now's Ann McNamara also explains for us what shipping companies like UPS are doing to keep up with your holiday deliveries. This is becoming a familiar sight in neighborhoods across the country. A delivery man working for a major shipping company driving around a U-Haul truck. So don't be alarmed if one comes to your door. They should actually get excited because it probably means uh, there's a present, there's a good thing coming. So uh, yeah, for sure, don't freak out. Uh, it's just your local FedEx or UPS guy, even the United States Postal Service, delivering you something good. U-Haul rents out equipment to companies like FedEx, UPS, and even the Postal Service to take on the extra demand. The vehicles range in size from cargo vans to the traditional U-Haul box truck. Anything it takes to get those bulk deliveries there on time. We live here, we work here, and you know we're happy to be able to help out any way we can. And part of the way we can do that is by providing trucks and trailers in some cases to the shipping companies to be able to make all their deliveries this time of year. Here's how to tell if the driver is legit. Companies like FedEx and UPS put magnets on the driver's side door and drivers must be in the company uniform carrying a company issued ID. You can ask to see it before they drive away. For the now, I'm Ann McNamara. Now, I didn't know this, but UPS says it's been renting equipment for 50 years. One reason you may also see more U-Hauls on the road is all those online purchases.